Welcome to this uh, Windows Computer and Technology channel and um, because of, you know, I get questions all the time about computer performance, slowdowns, crashes, blue screens, and of course the number one uh, culprit all the time is Windows. As a tech guy I can tell you that 99% of all blue screens are not Windows related. They have some other aspect there are some other reason why it's happening and um, the first one so we'll have several videos in a row with the different things you can check out the first one and especially when you're in the summertime or if it's hot where you are um, is hair that doesn't flow through your computer so this is an example of vents that are on the side and sometimes on the bottom of laptops. Um, if you have a desktop, usually in the back and the front, you might have um, airflow going through. You'll have fans. Uh, there's a way the air actually flows through a PC. It's not just decided that let's put a fan here and that's okay. Usually there is a, a direction where the airflow is going because the air needs to get in through one part of the PC but out through another part of the PC. That's how it cools down. The biggest problem is clogged vents because dust will actually stick here and will over time create a big chunk of dust blocking the vents. If it's humid or there's a lot of humidity, it might actually create some kind of weird goo that is a little disgusting. If there's a smoker, or if you are a smoker, uh, these are often the worst PCs that I see because they actually have a yellowish goo from the uh, smoke from cigarettes. And that goes through the vents with the dust and everything, and it just sticks there. Of course, that's one of the number one reasons your PC might, first of all, slow down. Notice your PC is slowing down. Maybe it's hot. Today's PCs, most processors will have what we call throttling. The processor monitors temperature, temperature rises too high. To reduce the amount of heat, it's going to slow down the clock speed. That also means it's going to slow down your PC. That's one reason. Blue screens that are happening regularly could be done, caused by this also. Why? Overeating of hardware will often make that hardware unstable and crash. Often when the PC is cool, it works fine. Then it crashes at some point. If your PC typically never crashes within the first half hour, ever, 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 but crashes often after 30 minutes, look at the airflow. Make sure that the vents are clean. The best way to do this would be to, of course, use a professional service to have your computer cleaned but if you don't have the money or you don't want to, you know, you want to try something at home first, what you could do is use a can of compressed hair. These are available for cheap everywhere. Computer stores will have some. And you can slightly, and, and don't go too heavy on the compressed hair because that compressed hair is very powerful. Um, it can actually damage fans if it actually is forced too much. So you go with little streaks you know like um, not even a second each time and remove the dust and you'll see that there's a good chance you'll see some dust actually flowing out of the computer and you can try to unclog it in that way a little bit and it, that could help uh, I do not recommend using a vacuum cleaner because vacuum cleaners will or could sometimes um, pull stuff can actually suck parts it happened I've seen uh, some of uh, the clients that I have over time that use a vacuum cleaner inside of a desktop for example and of course it um, removed some of the little jumpers on the motherboard because they were sucked into the vacuum cleaner so it's never a good idea plus there's a, an issue of static that's possible with a vacuum cleaner that could damage um, the electronics uh, do this with the computer shut down closed and unplugged to make sure that nothing bad happens and that might be 
the reason why your computer's slowing down and has or has crashes or blue screens in Windows. And this is also valid for any types of machine you might have in any operating system that might not work the way you want. So clogged air vents is probably up there in the top reasons why your computer isn't behaving correctly. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.